So at work, we started having this little situation with an abundance of fruit flies or little flying insects that constantly hung around the food that we had, and they were really distracting and annoying. The company decided to invest in these little um, lantern-looking devices that were very ornate and very attractive-looking, but they also emanated a blue, I would guess you would say, ultraviolet light that attracted the insects. So they no longer hung around our desk or our food, but they went directly towards the light. And as they hit the light, you would hear a zapping sound, meaning that they were killed instantly. So we have eliminated the situation, but all day long now I'm hearing zapping sounds. And I know these insects are dying. I'm using the lava lamp to symbolize the lantern because, of course, the lantern's at work and I don't have a chance to film the actual lantern. But as I'm sitting there at my desk and I'm hearing the zaps, it reminds me of the scripture that says that Satan appears as light, an angel of light. You see, he attracts us humans by our desires. Our desires could be fame, fortune, marriage, success, careers. It could be anything that you are so desiring that is drawing you towards his light. You see, he's a counterfeit. He can't create real, true light as God does. But he counterfeits a light that draws people who are not rooted and grounded in scripture to him. And the minute you get to this light, you're being zapped. You're being killed. Spiritually and sometimes physically. So what I'd like you to take the opportunity to do is to sit and reflect on what what light is drawing you in. What desires do you have that is luring you away from the real light, the light of God? The Bible also says that we are drawn away by our own lust. You see, the enemy studies you and he knows your weaknesses. He knows what to do to attract you. Just like that lantern at work, that blue light, for some reason, attracts those bugs and they draw into it. I mean, I'm constantly hearing zapping sounds all throughout the day. And it's amazing me that they no longer want to be around the food, but they want to go towards this light. So again, stop and ask yourself, what is drawing you? Is it something that's going to take you towards truth? And your purpose? Or is it something that's going to draw you away and kill you? That's all I'm asking. This lava lamp is not doing what it usually does. And I guess because it's old. But then again, aren't all the tricks of Satan old? Once you realize one trick and you overcome it, He can't get you with that same trick. And he doesn't have that many in his repertoire. Trust me. They get old pretty fast if you pay attention. Start paying attention.